Hey guys, welcome back. So in this video, we are going to see how to fetch the records from our database in our Spring Boot application. So let's get started. So previously we had inserted the student's record in our database and you can see. So when you just insert that, it will just return the response after storing it in the database. So now we are going to create a get API which will return the user list. So we are going to remove this one and we'll just do it here itself. Say public and this is going to be a list of student, right? So this is a list of student type and the function name we're going to say get students and the get mapping is students slash let me leave it empty. Okay. So when you just call the students, it is going to map to this function, okay? And in this method, we are going to say return student service dot get all students. Get all students. Okay, so this method we will create it in our service class first in the interface and then in the class okay say public list of students and this will be the method name get all students just import this take the one which is from java.util okay and yeah we will implement this in the impl file implement methods okay and you have got it over here instead of this say return student repository dot find all okay so I can just use this function it will return all the records from that table so save it and yeah so you can just test this in the postman just rerun the application once so it will load all the changes okay so the server has started so we'll go to our postman and we will copy this URL and paste it over here remove this store and keep the method as get send okay yeah so you can see the response we have got our records which is there in our database okay so we'll just create a new one keep the roll number as 789 and then click on send the data is inserted go to your get request and yeah you can see the latest record is also fetched over here and we have got all three records which is there in our database yeah we have three records over here you can see we have got the records from our database but now when you want to fetch a single record so we will just pass the ID of that user over here and when you send that particular user has to be returned over here. Okay. So for now it is telling not found. Let us create this in our code. So in your controller you can just copy this and paste it over here. Say get mapping of here we'll have the ID and say get student and this is not returning a list this will return a single student okay and here we'll say at path variable and that is going to be of type integer id okay copy that and pass it to this get all student 
I want to make it as get student or you can make it more specific get student by ID copy that and go to your student service say public student and paste the method name over here and we are passing an integer id go to your impl file say implement methods over here and just say student repository dot find by id and pass the id over here say dot get okay yeah and now you can go to your postman and then click on send We just reload the application. Okay, so the server is up and running now. Let's go to our postman and we'll add the ID over here. and you can see yeah we have fetched the record using the id okay so when i give one so that's it in this video guys we have seen how to fetch the records and a single record using the id from our database in postman using spring boot so thank you for watching this video guys please like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you